of Rob. Hello everyone and welcome to Rob's Rogues and this is a response video to ODC That's Me. He's running a 150 sub contest. Congratulations my friend. Um, I have uh, I would like to say I've been with him since the very beginning but it's been really close to the beginning. He hooked me up with a wonderful killer croc so uh, that's a thumbs up in my book. Uh, he's running a contest right now and he's asked to us to do a list and I kind of saw Chapman Films do a response video and I thought I'm gonna do one too. So his 150 sub uh, question that he's asking is uh, what is your favorite top five uh, DC or Marvel or other villains in general? Now you may be looking at yourself right here and going Rob who is this? Well this is another interest and love that I have. I'm a big music fan and one of my favorite bands is Kiss and this is the late great Eric Carr who passed away in 1991. This is his uh, action figure from uh, I think McFarland Toys or whatever. I have a whole KISS stage and a nice drum set, so this is one of my top two favorite drummers. Both of them are in KISS. The other one's not Peter Chris; it's Eric Singer, the current drummer. But this is Eric Carr, his action figure. So I thought this would be a little bit of a segue to show a different figure that I have. So uh, this is for ODC, that's me, and he only has 150 subscribers. So everybody, go down here at the bottom, click on his uh, link to his page, like him. He's a wonderful, great guy. He's got, he's funny. He has a lot of cool reviews so let's get his 150 subs up to 350 250 I'm going down 550 650 so like him so without further ado here are Rob's rogues right here this guy Eric Carr uh, <laughs> my top five I'm a big DC fan so these are my five one two three four five or if you count this way like this one two three four five <laughs> five come on Rob favorite DC villains, and I'm going to show all these in action figure form. Here we go. Number five. It's cold. It's Mr. Freeze, one of my favorite Batman rogues galleries. I love Mr. Freeze. Um, yeah, I can't say enough cool things about Mr. Freeze. Cool things, you get that? You see, see what I did right there? Mr. Freeze comes in at number five. It'll be a chilly, icy reception for you. Okay, Bad Arnold Schwarzenegger, but you get it. Mr. Freeze, number five. Number four, the muddy, the gooey, the sticky Mr. Not Mr. You know him. You love him. Clayface, number four. Uh, I've always been a big fan of Clayface. Uh, he was one of those in the comics initially that I was kind of like, eh, it was kind of cool, but the wonderful Batman animated series uh, made me love this character, and this is such a great action figure as well. I love this figure. Number four, Clayface. Number three, the big, the massive, the breaking of the bat. Bane. Oh, Nightfall made me love fall in love with the character Bane kind of made me uh, actually kind of uh, afraid of Bane when I saw him when I first initially uh, read him. Just a, such a big menacing character that could break Batman. Although I do think in the comics he broke Batman's back unfairly because he sent him on all these wild goose chases tracking down the Arkham Asylum inmates. But uh, Dark Knight Rises uh, really brought Bane uh, back since uh, the movie Batman and Robin did no good for the Bane. Bane character. Uh, this is the first Collect and Connect uh, figure that I put together. Uh, so it was really cool to have a big scaled looking Bane to uh, a scale in size to go with my uh, DC UC figure. So Bane comes in at number three. I will go up to the pesky Super Friends and rid the world of Superman. That's my dark side voice from the Superpowers or the Super Friends Hour. That's also for uh, Chapman Films, as he says, I have a very good radio voice. So number two, a villain of all time, is the big, massive Dark Side. And I just gotta say, this is the DC Collectibles version. I can't say enough good things about this. There is no way in the world I'm gonna pick up the Mattel version once I have this. He's worth every single penny. He is almost number one, but number one has a special place in my heart. Shh. I think you can hear number one coming around the corner. Shh. I have a secret to tell you. My favorite villain is Hush. 
I love the Hush character. This is the Arkham City Hush. I have the uh, Batman Hush, Hush figure, Hush Hush figure. Uh, Hush uh, took me by surprise reading that comic. Um, I instantly fell in love with Hush. Um, there's just something about this character. I would love to see a new 52 version of Hush. Um, he was a big point, or a big point for me in the Arkham City video game. I was glad to see his uh, inclusion in the video game. But Hush is my favorite villain of all time. I love the Hush character. Uh, the Lego Batman, uh, when you unlock Hush, he walks around, puts his finger to his mouth and goes, shh. I think that's really funny. Uh, that aside, I like the Hush stories that are out there. This is my favorite, favorite villain of them all. You may agree with some of these. You may not agree. But, hey, these are mine in ODC. That's me. Wanted to know what Rob's Rogue's favorite um, villains are. But what are your favorite villains? Let him know. Go down to his page. Just click the link. It'll take you five seconds. For each villain, uh, one second for each villain, type it really fast, let him know, and you could probably win a really cool prize. Hey, that's what I'm trying to do. That's what you should do. You should do. Go to ODC, that's me. Like, click, subscribe his uh, channel, and like he says, we'll see you on the flip side.